Hey Team Excel, this is Brian from Nashville. Just coming at you real quick with a introduction and a slight tutorial of the Enterprise Fleet Management app or the eFleets app. If you download the app and get into it and get your information put in, you're actually able to log your mileage for the day. Uh, you're able to find near service locations. So if you're out in a new area and don't know where to go, uh, your maintenance card is actually kept on here. Your insurance card, you can upload photos of that so that it's on there. The contact information of everyone that's at Excel or even with Enterprise that you might need. You can even file an accident report from the app. So this is just, overall, it's just a great app and it's a great tool for us to have out in the field. So for recording mileage, if you open up the app and click on the odometer bar, it's going to pull up a page with all of your odometer information. You go to the top right hand side and you're going to click on the plus sign and that's going to give you a new page where you're going to be able to add in information. On the information page you'll be able to input the start time or your, your start reading or your end reading depending on where you are during your day. Uh, miles driven will automatically show uh, so it calculates all of that for you. If you haven't driven between your previous end time, so if you finished work the previous day at 96604, you start your new reading at 96605, so miles driven is one, you would leave the personal miles box blank. Leave that as a zero, and that will be marked up as business miles. If, however, the previous day when you finished work uh, and you clocked out and you finished your, your mileage, you took a trip down to the grocery store or went to your kid's ball game or wherever, you do want to input, uh, when you start the next day, you do want to input that it was 100% personal miles. And then that will reset so that it, everything in the future will be business miles. So this morning when I started work and I inputted my mileage, I had driven a mile between my previous recordings. So I put 100% personal miles. I also down in the notes notated that my work 119.18 start. And at the end of the day, I'll put 119.18 end. Just to help me keep things clear about what drive times were for what and how many miles were driven for business. So as I said before, this app is going to be a very useful tool for us out in the field when we're out driving, especially when it comes down to finding a location for maintenance or service, uh, as well as being able to access the maintenance card from right there inside the app. That's very handy, very useful. Then also having all the contact information of everyone over at Enterprises uh, involved in our vehicles, as well as potentially being able to uh, file a, an accident report on the app uh, and request roadside assistance. So this app is very helpful. It's very powerful. Hopefully we can really be able to utilize this in the future and get the most that we can out of it. So I hope this helps and I hope you make the best of your day. See you next time.